Hello, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another Zero video. Where today I will be explaining how to get custom colors um, into your game. So um, you have this list here of colors: gold, blue, green, orange, pink, and stuff like that. Right now they are all the basic colors. Um, so if I start with pink, I will get this pink exactly like this one um, in game as well. So um, I uh, will explain you how to um, change these colors yourself. But there's one warning, you cannot play on um, Revora, aka CNC Online. So um, this section here, the multiplayer section that you go online, that one won't work. But you are still able to play on Game Ranger and Radmin, so the network part still works fine. So you can still play online using um, Game Ranger or Radmin. So uh, let's jump, let's go into it and uh, I will show you guys how to do it. All you need to do right now is go to your game directory. So go... Um, so I uh, go to local drive and go to program files 86 um, then go to um, origin games and um, for me it's origin games maybe for you it's EA games or if you um, I downloaded the game illegally it might be called something else uh, but for me it's origin games so click on origin games um, then go to um, section zero hour um, with origins you have to pre uh, do it two times so one, uh, once again another time I'm um, coming on zero hour for EA I think it's only one time and then you have um, your game directory I have a lot of extra stuff in it and it doesn't matter um, so what you need to do is go to data folder but if you don't have a data folder you can just quickly make one by just um, doing new I'm um, sorry my um, it is in Dutch so uh, yeah just go to new and then create folder. So just click on here and just name this file data. Like so. I'm not gonna do that because I don't need this file. Because I already have that one, so I just delete that. So once you have your data folder, open it. Um, you see I have a lot of um, folders here. Don't worry about it. Um, you don't have to worry about it at all. All you need is an any folder. Once again, if you don't have that one, just create it new and then create folder and name it any. That's how, how simple it is open this um for you there might be nothing in here um for me i have some custom um gear modifications like the custom gui bar and stuff like that and that's why this one is built what you want to do here is um, um open a new um text document uh once again for me it's dutch don't worry about it just open a new text folder um then you open this folder and just save as then you want to change it as um, multiplayer.ini. Like this, very simple, multiplayer.ini. Close this one, because you don't need that one, so you delete this. Um, and you see the multiplayer.ini folder, this one is empty. Um, but I have the other folder here, with the colors, so we're just gonna copy paste that. I will leave this entire block of text um, into the description. All you have to do is copy the um, copy it and paste it, or I'll, um, also um, leave a link if you want to just download this file and post it into your directory. That also works. So I'll just copy and paste this one here. Um, but one thing is, you'll see you have a lot more than only uh, the multiplayer colors. You have online chat colors um, and multiplayer settings. I suggest just leaving that how it be. Um, just don't touch these. Then at the bottom you'll also see a multiplayer starting money choice. Also just stay off that, you don't need that, don't touch that. That might actually cause mismatch and disconnections if you change this. What we can now change um, are these multiplayer colors. With eight of them, um, I suggest don't touch the tooltip name and the multiplayer color name just um, to make sure there are no disconnections or anything. What you can change are the RGB colors and night colors. But first of all, these are my custom colors. Um, so once you have this post um, put in your game already, you can actually um, interact already. You can actually just save this one and then go to your zero hour game. Now you can see the colors have already been changed um, to the colors I normally use. So these are my colors that I use, but I will show you um, as well how to change these colors yourself all these colors have changed they are becoming more brighter they've changed because those are the colors i use in my game so if you're not a star um this match you'll see that my color is bright pink I will obey. as well so Please it's bright pink and everything so now i'll show you how to change your colors 
It's not very difficult. So if you have your folder, uh, your multiplayer um, thing, just open it. And then we're gonna change these values here, the RGB colors. Um, let's say I want to change green, so just go to section, uh, multiplayer color, color green. And then we have, uh, we go to the internet. So all you have to do is go to RGB colors, color. So all you have to do, just click that, go in it, and then go to color RGB and we three schools. I find that the most interesting one, the most easiest one. I mean, it's all up to you to what um, what you want to do. We'll also leave a link in the description on how to go to this website. And then you will see you have the giant box of red. You have the R and G and the B. So the R here stands for the, the R um, down at the right hand side. It's just um, how many? Uh, the red, the red color. So you have three colors and that's how your colors are getting made. So we're changing the, the red one. The green one and the uh, B stands for blue. First of all, what color do we want? We want a dark ish green. So let's actually try and get a dark ish green. So let's say I want um, this color, but I want to maybe mix in a little bit of um, red, make a little bit more yellowish and blue, and maybe a little bit of blue, not much. So let's say I want this color. Okay, that green, I want that green, I like that green. Then you see here the values of um, the colors. So if RGB, again, red, green, and blue. The first one here, 65, um, that stands for red. So then we go to um, the color green here. We change the R here for RGB color, which um, changes number 115 to 65. Um, I'm gonna do the same for night colors. So the color doesn't change depending on the color um, in game. And then you see, um, Another one is for the green value. The middle one is for the green value. So we change the one for green. We change that to 101. Same here for the dark color, 101. And then we see blue. We have 21 of blue. Let's change the value to for blue. All we have to do now is save. And then we go ahead and start our game. Now you will see if I take green now. You see that the color has changed. Yeah, color green has changed completely. Um, it has now become a darker ish green. And that's how easy you can do it. You can do it for all eight colors. I suggest not adding more colors because once again, that can cause mismatches. So right now I have a very dark green. If I start now, and um, you can see in game, it's also a very a dark green. Uh, you can make it super light, you can make it all the colors yellow, you can make all the colors pink, you can, you can have 50 shades of pink in your game, 50 shades of grey in your game, I mean 8 shades of grey in the game, you all, all you want. Um, but yeah, the colors now change for all units. Um, it looks a little bit lighter on the infantry I'm units and stuff, um, that is normal. Yeah, that's how you change the colors in your game, you can do it for every color you want to. And uh, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this little guide on how to change your in-game colors um, to whatever colors you see fit. But only one thing is you cannot play on Revora or um, TNC Online, uh, the other name it's called. Um, but yeah, if you want to play on those, just drag that file out of your um, out of that folder, and that way uh, you can still play on Revora. And um, yeah, that's all. That all works fine. Game Ranger and Ravmin still work with these colors. So yeah, quick guys, I hope you got it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, if you want to see more videos of me playing free for all, uh, bugs, um, and more guides, let me know it down in the comments and uh, like and subscribe. And uh, um, to help out the channel, I will hopefully see you guys later on. Have a good day and uh, bye bye.